Hey guys, well I've just got done watching Army of the Dead and well done to everyone involved in this because this is fantastic. I I highly recommend watching this movie guys. I I really do. If if you're a, if you're a, you know a horror zombie movie fan, if you you know, if, if you're an action fan, it, it, this film has everything. It really does. And for two and a half hours long, it really didn't feel it at all. It, it, it flew past. I wanted more. I easily could have sat there and had another hour of this movie. <laughs> I, re I loved it. Absolutely loved it. So for the, the plot of the movie basically is, um, unfortunately, there's been a zombie apocalypse has happened. And they've managed to wall them off in uh, Las Vegas. Um, and I think the I think it's like about a, a few years later, um, a shady businessman uh, comes to see Dave the Animal Batista. That's my really bad Vince McMahon impression. I'm sorry. I just had to do it. So he <laughs> goes and sees um, Dave the Animal Batista. Um Gives him a proposition if he can get into Las Vegas and get two million dollars of his money, which is locked in a fault, and get it out in time before there's an airstrike and nuclear bomb wipes out Las Vegas. He gets to keep 50 million of it and share it with his team that he's recruited to go in and get it. That is basically the plot of the movie, and I will say no more than that because I really do not want to spoil this. There's so many twists and turns this film takes. And I, I I loved it. I absolutely loved it. Like like the zombie genre has been done to death. You know what I mean? But this really oh, this just ups at a level for me. There's something fresh in here that you haven't seen before. And I don't want to get too much into it because I'll be going into spoilers. But just trust me when I say. You have your norm, your normal zombies, like your slow moving ones, shamblers they call them, and then you have these other mob that are just, you do not want to bump into these at all. Like they, they was <laughs> put it this way, the slow moving ones I think I would fancy my chances with. These other ones, no chance, man. You're lasting about five seconds with these guys. I'm telling you, God, like there's this one fight scene. Dave Batista and this zombie, and, and it lasts about, it's only a few seconds long, but you have never seen a zombie move like this. You've never seen it. And you're just thinking, fuck that, I'm, I'm out, <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> I wouldn't last two seconds. Oh man, oh, I loved it. The, everyone in this movie brings the Ray game. Everyone's brilliant, there's not a weak Weak performance in this film for me. You know what I mean? And Dave Batista, fair play to you, man. You got me a couple of times your performance. I'm not going to lie. There's a couple of heartfelt moments in this movie and I, I teared up a little bit. Surprised me. I weren't expecting it. But um, you delivered a really good performance, man. Fair play to you. I Fair play to you. You were great. Everyone was great. And there's, oh, the head zombie guy in this is terrifying yeah you would not want to come face to face with this guy and if you did uh you you, you know a few seconds later you're you're not around anymore <laughs> basically put it that you're not around anymore or you're turning into a zombie you know one or the other but um yeah guys honest to god get on this movie really get on it you won't be disappointed you really won't um i believe there's going to be a prequel movie to this i think um, so I'm looking forward to seeing that, and it obviously sets up a universe um, from this movie, which I want more of. I want to see more of this. I really do. I, oh, it's five out of five, guys. Honest to God, it, it's five out of five. I had so much fun watching it. I haven't had this much fun watching a movie. For, for a long time. Actually, I think the last fun I had watching a film was another Snyder movie, was Justice League, which I think is a masterpiece. 
an absolute masterpiece. Like, it was so much better than the Josh Whedon, like so much better than the Josh Whedon one. God, the Josh Whedon one just doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> it just, thank God, it doesn't exist. It's gone. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you for joining me as always. And I think my next review. Oh, I don't know, because I said I was going to take a break from the old ones because the mutilator <laughs> hit my soul. <laughs> um, but I've come across one called Blood Rage. And I think it's hooked me back in. I think that's going to be the next one I do. Mm, we'll see. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Get on Army of the Dead. Get on it. I promise you, you won't be let down. And as always, guys, take care of yourselves and be good to each other. Thank you.